Hey guys, uh, I'm Phoenix here. Um, I made a sort of a start of a tutorial quite some time ago, um, uh, getting a Blender UV into Unity, and it's something that I actually never finished because I hit a load of weird issues with it and um, couldn't quite work out what was going on. Um, now I know what's going on, I can then make a video for it and show you why models sometimes appear black in Unity. So here we have um, Blender and I'm just going to pull up a bench. So this is a model which I currently don't have any UV on as you can see. I'm going to hit tab and I'm going to hit A and I'm going to go to unwrap smart UV project and as you can see, it's huge. It's going off the off the side. It does this. So with it, that sort of selected type thing, uh, you hit A, and then you hit S to scale it all down, G to move it around. I'm just gonna um, scale it sort of to the page. That do. Then I'm going to export it uh, into my materials folder. Is, yeah, and then I'm going to export. Final thing I'm going to do is I'm going to save the file again. For some reason, if you make a UV map and then you don't, and then you export it to a PNG or whatever, um, and then you don't save it when you put it into Unity, it's just going to come back black. So I'm going to go back to Unity, and I'm going to go to my materials and I'm just going to make a material um, the bench I'm going to change the uh, texture to the bench there it is and then find your bench model um, which I think it's under outside, there it is uh, dump it in the scene somewhere and then get rid of animation because otherwise the model won't show it's an interesting new uh, feature and then where it says material element zero just change that to your bench material which is somewhere up here, there it is and there you have it, it's now textured as you can see by all the lines um, showing where all your vertices and extensions have been so that's how you get a texture from a uh, sort of UV map from Blender to Unity and then you can just edit that into in any sort of text editor or the Blender tools or whatever you need to do. So thanks for watching and I will see you on Tuesday.